Hello and welcome. My name is Bethany. I'll be your facilitator for the next four weeks as we look at curating and evaluating resources. Now as instructional designers, we spend a lot of time looking for really great resources, whether those resources are for ourselves and our own personal growth and development or resources for others. Now we need, because we do that so much, we need really great strategies in place to help us effectively, quickly and effectively find resources, evaluate them to decide if they're worth our time and effort or whether we should just look for some, discard those and look for something else. Then collect them in some sort of organized fashion and finally share them out to others. So that is our four weeks in a nutshell, basically what we'll be doing. Uh, we'll, the whole workshop will be culminating in a collection of resources and a document that utilizes those resources in some way. More on that in a minute. All right. But first, of course, week one, we kick off everything with some community building um, through, of course, an intro discussion. So we can share a little bit about ourselves as much as you want or as little and how much you already know or what you already know about the topic. I'll kick us off. Um, as I said, my name is Bethany and you can already probably tell a little bit about me by what's in the screen here. Um, a lot of yarn. I like to knit and crochet and weave. I also do some long distance biking and a bunch of other stuff. Um, we'll save that for the discussion forums. I'm also quite the geek. I have multiple computers. I should join Geeks Anonymous or something. <laughs> anyway, I'll, I, like I said, I'll save the rest for the discussion forums and I'm looking forward to getting to know uh, all about you as well. And um, yeah, in the meantime though, let me go ahead and share my screen and kind of orient you to the workshop and get started on the right foot. All right, so here we are in the workshop. Um, this is Moodle for those of you who are not familiar. Um, and we have it set up so that the navigation uh, buttons are on the left. You can get around to the various sections. The welcome is the home page. Whenever you log into the course, if you just log in without a direct link to a specific section, this is where you'll end up. And the welcome section is great because there's some help there about navigating if you want some more details. There's a help forum where you can post your help questions. You can also get more of my contact info like phone number and stuff in case you'd prefer to call or text me rather than post in the forum. A water cooler to share random fun and a news forum. This is where I will post and I post several times a week. Um, some of it is like specific and relevant content like a discussion summary or grading info and so on. Others is just, you know, optional, interesting information. I will make sure I mark the optional stuff so you can decide whether to save it, ignore it, whatever you want to do. All right. But you are responsible for what is posted in the news forum. So I recommend that this is your first stop every time you log into the workshop. Make sure you haven't missed anything. Okay. I also will post media and stuff in this area here. All right. So that's a little bit about this environment. Um, there's live session information posted all here, but it's also posted each week. So I'm going to go ahead and go to week one. Just to kind of give you a heads up, we've got our intro discussion. Look, some people have already posted. Yay! All right. Um, due dates are listed below all of the activities that have a deadline. Um, the discussions generally have a due date where your initial response to the discussion prompt is due on one day and then your replies to others or your responses to others are due on another day. So that's how those break down. We've got your planning ahead. This is that final project I was telling you about and all the major assignments, definitely check that out. And then we've got every week, we have some scheduled live sessions. 
those are optional. Um, but I do hope you attend. We tend to have a lot of fun in those and yeah. And besides, I, I enjoy it. And then some more readings and some optional activities and another graded activity. So definitely check that out. All right. So you can check out the other stuff and I will share information every week when it becomes relevant about that particular week. Cause I don't want to weight you down with all sorts of stuff. That's not coming due for four weeks. You've got enough to think about. <laughs> Same with grading. After I grade the first activity, I'll go ahead and post uh, share information with you. Sorry, there's a bug flying around. I'll share information with you about uh, how I grade and where you can check the grade book and all that sort of stuff. Again, when it's relevant. All right. So that's it. I'm looking forward to uh, interacting with you over the next four weeks. For those of you who I just had an ID one, welcome back. Yay. <laughs> and for those of you who are new, Thank you for joining us. I'm really looking forward to getting to know you. All right, that's it. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.